honestly, I, I mean, it is, I just feel like it's such a, an amazing experience for everyone involved, uh, for our players to have the fans right on top of the field, uh, for the fans to be in a warm, cozy environment where they can, you know, see the action right there and, and see the beauty of uh, the teams battling against each other and um, and then also the, the beauty of the lakeside right there. It's, it's truly an incredible thing. And then we have had some just amazing battles in there. Uh, I feel really lucky that, um, you know, we've had great competition come out to play us. And, you know, that, that it just elevates our game and, and puts on a show for, for everyone involved. We had a pretty monster stretch in terms of timing and, and quality of play. Um, in, in the first several weeks of the season. So um, it was nice to have the weekend off and kind of for everyone to rejuvenate and the girls have brought great energy into this week. We're kind of looking at this as our next segment. Um, but it, you know, I think when you looked at our schedule, like a lot of people were like, what are you thinking? But, um, you know, it helps you, it helps you get strong and learn really quickly when you play great competition like that back to back to back. And I think our girls really took it very seriously. They put a ton of effort into it. And I think that we've improved as a program and now it's up to us to continue to do that. Yeah, these girls are an amazing group. I think they, they really are a core of our uh, team. They've been the core of our team for so long, even when they were freshmen, just because they were uh, uh, such a big group. So, um, you know, it's been it's been amazing to kind of see them step into the leadership role, to see them develop from their first year till now. And I think there's still so much potential uh, moving forward into the rest of this year. So I'm excited that we can kind of celebrate this early on, celebrate them and, and all the work that they've put into this season thus far and the seasons before, but then also get excited about what's ahead for this group and, and how much they really impact this team. Uh, yeah, I think we had a good first four game segment. Um, obviously, Syracuse, Starting off, um, didn't get the result we wanted, but we learned a lot from that game. Um, it was the first game of the year, which is no excuse because obviously it was their first game too. But um, yeah, I think we were fortunate to have that as our first game um, and learn a lot from that and be able to turn it around quickly to get some big wins against Notre Dame and BC um, and then another one against Marquette. Uh, I think just really trying to each game, take the data and learn from it and implement that into our next game. And um, yeah, just keep getting better every game. Uh, yeah, I think just really strong team play. I think we've had a lot of contributors, which is great. And the more we can kind of keep that going and have seven people scoring at any point um, and having everyone be a threat, the harder we're going to be to scout. So I think obviously, you know, Izzy's made a great return scoring. I don't think she's averaging eight goals a game or something crazy, but um, on top of that, just having a bunch of people step up and score goals when we need it the most. You know, we had Dylan put in five against BC, um, Sammy and Sam coming through the midfield, obviously Maddie Taylor, L. So just really like a lot of uh, strong weapons on offense and people who can put the ball in the back of the net and be a threat. Yeah, I think the crowds are huge. Um, it's such an electric atmosphere inside when we have those those games in there and the stands are packed and there's people standing. I mean, literally there was not room for everyone to sit. So. Um, they're just really big for momentum during those games, and I think sometimes when you go on the road and you don't have those crowds, um, and you get you get down or you get behind by a couple goals. It's harder to come back. But you know, when we started making that comeback, we had a lot of people behind us, and I think that really helped us um, finish the game out and come out with a win, especially in BC. So we started off um, not the best against Syracuse, and I think that was really important for us because we realized how much more work we need to do and how much harder we need to go in practice so that we can be where we want to be. Um, and then I think Notre Dame and BC, we just finally like attacked the other team and thought about um, who we are and bringing respect back to Northwestern. 
and kind of that we're the underdog and no one really wants to see us winning. So I think that shift in mindset really has been carrying us um, and is really important to focus on through the, throughout the rest of the season. Yeah, defense has been pretty good. Um, we've been trying a bunch of different things and I think it's really great how flexible we are and how we can shift into different game plans midway through the game or whenever we need to. So I think that's our greatest like attribute. Um, we obviously have Molly and she's just been incredible and has a great attitude and energy and presence in the cage. So I really think that um, those two together have helped the defense and we're just gonna continue to grow from here.